Our conversation today has been so interesting. I'm so mm-hmm. glad you guys got together. But I want to know, how do you guys feel about tradition? I mean, you guys know how I feel personally. <laughs> and I know y'all laughing. Basically, I would say, fuck tradition. Um, any other traditions back home that I still like? I think my favorite one will be the knocking. And those watching, um, the knocking is when you meet a guy and he officially goes to your parents and he pays a little something and say, you know, I've met Millie, I'm in love, I have plans on marrying her. I think that's the only part that I like. It's almost like an engagement, kind of, Mm -hmm. like my hands are on her. So if you see Millie bringing any other guy home, no, he's not allowed, kick him out. (laughs) But... I think one of the main reasons why I hate the traditions um, is because when I was going through my divorce, you know, six months down the line, um, I bumped into a lady that I used to go to church with. And she was like, you know, you have to go back home and finalize things. And I'm like, wait, you know, I paid the lawyer. Mm -hmm. All of that stuff is done. She's like, no, no, no. You're technically you're not divorced. And I was like, and she was like, yeah, technically you're not divorced. And I was like, what are you talking about? And she was like, you don't want you don't want to be accused of cheating because that'll happen once you start um, dating somebody. And I was like, wait. So I made a phone call, a few phone calls here and there. And they were like, oh, did you do the traditional part? (laughs) And I was like, wait, hold on. That's a done deal. They took the drinks. You know, they enjoyed it. Everybody got their money, the mom, the this and that. That's a whole different ballgame. So I had to buy a ticket, Mm -hmm. go to Ghana. Somebody had to go and announced to my ex-in-laws the reason why I was in Ghana. And then I had to go a few days later and I went and my ex-in-laws, you know, it was almost like, please don't leave. We love you, this and that and that. Mind mind you, (laughs) I have been gone for like six, seven, eight months. Mm -hmm. So it was like, oh my God, you know, I'm sitting there and I'm like, oh my God, no, 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 like stop. (laughs) So then, you know, my ex-father-in-law, may he rest in peace, he was like, um, how about you go home and think about this, you know? Where that you've you, already been um, divorced for like, what, eight months? Well, legal part, in my head, we're done. Not even in my head, legally, we're done. <laughs> but traditionally, we're not. It's a whole process. So three days, I go back, and then he's like, you know what? On second thought, you know, maybe you've met somebody. Maybe you've been cheating on my son. Maybe oh, this, maybe that. Dang. And I'm just sitting there this whole time like, you know what? I'm being very respectful, but I just want this to be done. Mm-hmm. So then um, his big brother was like, well, when we came and did the traditional marriage, um, the person that you came with um, today yeah. wasn't there. Yeah. We need your family. Mm-hmm. Mind you, apparently, you know, Amongst the elderly, it's Mm -hmm. shameful to get Mm -hmm. divorced. So nobody from my family wanted to support me. Mm -hmm. So the caretaker of my house was the one I was like, we need to get this done. I pay him so he couldn't say no. (laughs) (laughs) But he was there when we got married. So he went with me. So then it it got really heated. And I've heard, and I don't know the truth behind this, um, when you're, you know, getting rid of the traditional marriage, the bride herself doesn't go because mm-hmm. things get heated. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So here I am sitting there in this short, short booty dress, legs crossed, six inches stripper heels. <laughs> and um, my ex-brother-in-law was like, you need to go bring somebody that was there. Da, 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 da. We don't know him. And I said, yes, you do. And then again, my ex-father-in-law was nice. Out of nowhere, he said, did you bring the drinks with you? I said, no. He said, get out of here right now. Go get the drink and then we'll end this marriage right now. But that whole process alone drained me mentally. And I was like, you know what? All these traditions, are they even worth it? Fuck it. I don't care about them. So I don't. I I completely get Two people (laughs) fall in love. We got married. Mm -hmm. It didn't work out. Mm -hmm. It's a done deal. I paid an attorney. I filed a divorce. Months down the line, there's something called a traditional marriage that you have to get rid of, You did the traditional when you were getting married, correct? You did the traditional when you were getting married, correct? Okay, you get engaged, right? A guy proposes, right? When he goes on his knees and proposes and engages you, do you reverse the engagement? That's not what I asked you. You did 
get a you, traditional you, you, right? because the traditional that's not what I asked wait you. hold on the traditional <laughs> marriage right doesn't mm -hmm. that represent your engagement it does right but, but also in Africa that's there are marriage. certain things that you also did you guys brought drinks together mm -hmm. as much as you were done physically let's talk about spiritually. and legally let's talk about spiritually yeah you know what then forget it i will never go through that. that process <laughs> again and that's the thing but, but you I, know what I, I was very fortunate because they had my ex-in-laws had an option of saying we're not taking the drinks. Of course, and if of they course. if they didn't take it at that time, mm -hmm. we still would have been married. Technically, Technically. and that's what I'm yeah, saying. Spiritually, you. there I'm are not things going through that, that again. Even if it's a banana, one of these bananas sitting here, mm -hmm. there are things attached to mm -hmm. when you're married or married to somebody. It's a spiritual mm -hmm. thing. It's not just True. a physical thing. It's not just a sign in a paper. Take the spiritual aspect out. The traditional you can't, you part. Can't. No, because when you, you got married, you put the traditional part. I am not. I really. You so, can't take it out. Can't. When you got married, you mentioned God, you mentioned Jesus, the Holy Spirit. You mentioned all of that. There, there might be a but. Maybe in the future, if Bill Gates is divorced or Don Gote or one of them. <laughs> Maybe I'll go through that process, but if not, fuck it. No, but I'm the done. thing, the the, the the whole traditional thing, go well, that traditional marriage. Mm -hmm. It's in Africa. That's our wedding. That's mm -hmm. what we call our. But wedding. But then you have a wedding after that too. That's the Western thing, mm -hmm. and I everybody Agreed. is saying, oh, you gotta do it. when you do the, the the traditional wedding. You gotta have that white, white wedding. wedding. You gotta go buy mm -hmm. it. That's a it. that's the British kind of thing going mm -hmm. on. I don't there. want it. Our wedding, typically, when you think about it, mm -hmm. is the, the traditional one. The African mm -hmm. one. I don't want to mm -hmm. do. Because the whole thing is a whole celebration. So, we're standing there. We exchange your me. ring. We mm -hmm. He puts a ring on your finger. Mm -hmm. Y'all are having a whole And, and there's a whole family. There. family it's a whole wait. family witnessing from okay, both sides. Okay, I have a question. You're engaged. You're in a relationship. You're single. Mm -hmm. Let's say you meet an African-American man, right? Mm -hmm. Knows nothing about Africa and our traditions. Mm -hmm. You are madly in love. Like, you meet this guy called Gordon. He's like, drop dead Ooh. gorgeous. <laughs> all that's a bell. Let me ask you. He doesn't want that. You love him to death. Will you say, you know what, ditch tradition. Let's move forward. He proposes, you get engaged, you start planning your wedding. Let's go to the altar. Let's do this, baby. Or let's go to the courthouse, baby. Let's sign and deliver this. Will you do it and fuck tradition? Ooh. Okay, I'm going to answer this. As soon yes or no? Yeah. Give me a yes or no first. I'm not going to give you a yes or no. So you're not sure. Mine is a I'm no. Not, I'm not going to give is a no. no. Mine, I'm so gonna you do know, the support I'm going to make him do the knock-in. I'm going to make, think, because if on. he respects me, he respects all of me. Okay. If I, guys, my, the tradition you know is a part of I won't, me. I won't give you a yes or no. It's you talking about two people mm -hmm. with two different backgrounds, with mm -hmm. two families. Mm -hmm. Okay. Before... Gordon met me. Hi, Gordon. <laughs> Before Gordon met me, mm -hmm. I had a family. Okay, mm -hmm. so if I am African, mm -hmm. which I am, mm -hmm. and Gordon wants to marry me, in Africa, marriage is mostly about the family. Mm -hmm. So he has to understand that I have traditions. I come with baggage. He mm -hmm. comes with baggage. Then your answer is okay. no. Yeah, but okay. but. The way she She's put it, explain why the way she mm. put it, that's why I didn't want to give her a yes or no answer mm. because that wouldn't be enough. Okay. Yeah. Be so because mm -hmm. of your family, mm -hmm. you would want that traditional. I, mean, I was born in the tradition. I am the tradition. A fact. A hundred percent. I am the tradition. And the thing is, and the thing is, mm -hmm. he's coming in. They gain. My family is gaining a son. A son. His family is gaining getting a, a daughter. daughter. If anything should happen to me, my family know where to go mm -hmm. to go ask questions mm -hmm. from. Now, say you don't take the, you don't do the traditional thing. You're uh -huh. all like, oh, let's just run away. Let's elope. Elope. Don't do this. If something let's, happens, let's do the biggest when thing. When <laughs> elope, who your family gonna ask? Cause they don't know about this mm -hmm. thing. They know you've been fucking. They know you, you be, girl, how many They people, know you're with him, but Listen, still, they, they got a whole, they have this, so you have to come in front and be like, yo, I'm accountable for your daughter now. I'm accountable for your son now. If you, if you can't find him, it's me that you're calling. If you can't find her, you're the one I'm calling. How many of your African friends you know do that? My African friends that I know that do what? That they, you know, they're like, okay, if anything happens to Millie, this, that, and that, it's on me. If they're serious, all of them. If they are serious, oh, yeah, all that, and that, here's the thing, African men here, 
they really seem like okay, they're not serious. Mm -hmm. But then when they when they're ready to, to get married, down. they go they go back to the things that they know. They go and back to the way their mother likes it. They go back to they can, oh what yeah, what what, what looks presentable to my mother to my family. Tradition. They 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 go way back. back. And they can look Americanized as well. Oh. When they're ready. Okay. They're going back. They go way back. They, they go start back. going to church. They want to pray. They will, they will be the Sunday service.